Well, howdy, everybody. It's your buddy, the Texan Detector. And I hope you're having a wonderful day. It's a beautiful day out here at one of my local parks. I may hit a couple parks today. I'm feeling froggy. I'm having a good day. Um, I got to say, um, I was having some really good luck there for a while with the channel. Well, the channel had been growing. Uh, October, I got my, my monthly report, best month ever. November, best month ever. December, best month ever. January dropped a little bit. Well, I understood. I was like, well, you know, I guess people have more spare time with the holidays and they're home with their families and whatnot. And they have more time to scroll through YouTube. So I didn't really worry about it. But February, once again, best month ever. And I sure appreciate the heck out of all y'all who made that happen. Um, I actually had an interesting comment on, uh, in my group from a, a subscriber. I uh, don't want to mention his name because I don't know if he wants himself out there like that. But he said that him and his daughter love watching my channel. They're local, so they know the parks that I hunt. And if um, they're into metal detecting as well. So I hope y'all are out there having some fun. Dust off that old metal detector and get out there in the tight light and have some fun. <laughs> but anyway, back to the lecture at hand. I'm at this beautiful tight lot. I got my note to legend with me. I got my note to double score with me. We're going to have some fun. So pack up your metal detector in your mind let's go see what the heck we can find but you know what's most important right having a good time yes sir all right well i'll get back with y'all when i'm out there and i have a metal detector in my hand and a good tone in the land yes sir Well, all right, y'all. I got me a 27 right here. Now, normally I would think that was either a nickel or a pull tab, but it's kind of a iffy signal, so. So very well could be, well, it is a ring pool. <laughs> First target of the day, a ring pool. Woohoo! Well, let's put in the old pockeroonie and let's keep on keeping on. Well, yeah, I got me a 44 here. It's kind of iffy. It's around a bunch of trash, but. Should be right around yonder. Let's see what we got, y'all. Mm. Doesn't sound as good as I thought there for a minute, but let's see. Maybe I just didn't go deep enough. Hey, hey, it is a deep dime that I thought it might be. Woohoo! Well, I think it's a dime. No? Are you kidding me? Y'all gotta be joking, right? 
first coin of the day is a freaking wheat penny, y'all. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Yes, sir. It's a very orange one, so it's been here for quite a while. Let's see if we can't get a date off of it. 1944, baby. <laughs> All right. Well, we got us a wheat penny on the board. Look at that beautiful one cent. Woo! First coin of the day. I've dug one target other than this, it was, which was a ring pool. Uh, and I got me a wheat penny. Look at that one cent. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. All right, y'all. Let's keep on keeping on. Uh, the other day I was detecting here, my first target was a wheat penny. So maybe this is a good spot. I, I haven't really uh, detected this area very hard. I'm always why I'm detecting here now is because I was about to go to the top lot and a family showed up there. So I was just like, well, I'll hit under the trees while they're over there playing. But hey, got us a wheat penny on the board. Let's keep on keeping on, baby. Well, y'all, I got me another signal here. Should be right there if I had to guess. My little wiggle pinpoint method I got, I always do. Oh, shoot. Well, I think it's still in the hole there. Let's see. I'm still having a hard time. Oh, shoot. <laughs> well, nothing good. It's a bottle cap. I'm still having a hard time figuring out where to put my pinpointer and my digger since they're on the same hip now. But uh, I'm starting to figure it out. Starting to figure it out. All right, y'all. Well, we got some bottle cap on the on the board. Let's keep on keeping on. Well, all right, y'all. I'm over here still sifting through the trash pit waiting to get to the top lot and... I got me a 51 right there, and anybody that detects with the double score or the legend, I don't know. That right about here should be a quarter. And I don't know if y'all see that, but it's definitely a quarter. All right, y'all. It's not a very old quarter. It looks like a, hey, it's a Texas quarter. I will take that every day of the week. <laughs> I like finding quarters. All right, let's keep on keeping on. Hopefully the kids are getting tired and I'll get to hit the top lot in a minute. All right, y'all, on to the next one. Well, y'all, I got me another high signal here, but I'm not as hopeful on this one. It is a... It's a 51, which should be a quarter. There's a lot of junk around it, so it could be a can. Okay. I know where it's at. It should be right there. Uh oh, hope I didn't throw it across the field there. I see it. Do you see it? It is another quarter. This one is not a Texas quarter. This is, well, this is maybe praying. I don't know. <laughs> but it is a quarter nonetheless. We'll throw it in the pocket. We'll keep on keeping on. On to the next one, baby. That's two quarters in a row. Yes, sir. 
Well, I got a scratchy dime signal here, and that's not what I expected. But that is one heck of a chunk of lead. I will put it in the pocket, and we'll keep on keep it on, baby. Should be right there. Should be a quarter. Let's see if we can pop it out in the plug. Yep, we got some nice 50 in the plug, y'all. There we go, y'all. Look at that. We're at where I thought it was going to be. Got us another quarter on the line, dig, baby. <laughs> Got a 2526. Y'all want to see me pull this, uh, dig this pull tab? That's probably what it is. But it's too close to the nickel and gold ring range for me to pass up. So, oh, look at there. It is a nickel. I told y'all. I should have said gold ring first. <laughs> Ugh, that didn't sound good either, but I'm going to go for it because it was a pretty 46, and that's normally a dime or silver, so. But as I pulled off of it, it sounded ugly in here, in here. It's getting ugly, ugly, ugly. See, now it's in the plug and it's a 44, which kind of makes me think it might be a screw top. Nope, it is a coin, must be a copper penny, well, oh no, no, <laughs> y'all, this is my second wheat penny of the day, just detected a, a, a modern park, and y'all seen this live, so y'all know, 54, baby, Woo! <laughs> That's why it sounded kind of like a dime, kind of like a penny, because it was a wheat penny. <laughs> uh, well, all right, y'all. I came to a different tot lot here, and I got me a signal. Probably just a penny. We're going to find out together, because I have found some pretty cool stuff. It is just a penny. It is a 1997 Memorial Penny. But we'll take it. This is the ring where I found... I mean, this is the, <laughs> the ring. This is the park where I found two back-to-back -back silver rings on. So, uh, anything in the 40s, I'm definitely going to show y'all. All right, y'all. On to the next one. Well, all right, y'all. Here's a, another interesting one. Mostly 42, 43, kind of depends on which way I swing. I did have a 38 there for a minute. No! A little shock top, a little uh, bottle top. Well, we had to dig it. I had to show y'all. All right, let's keep on keeping on. Well, all right, y'all, here goes another one. It's mostly a solid 27, but there's a bunch of trash here, so it's hard to tell. Huh. Here we go. No. <laughs> I had a feeling it might be a pull tab, but hey, well, I'm going to show y'all what I dig. That's what I dug. <laughs> it's the reality of metal detecting. All right, y'all, on to the next one. Well, all right, y'all, this one sounds a little better. 
Solid 26. That should be a nickel unless it's something better. Is that it? No! What the heck is that, y'all? It is from the Ming Dynasty. That's what that is. That's a Chinese uh, um, relics. <laughs> no, nah, that's some junk. All right, y'all, on to the next one. Well, here's something that sounds a whole lot better than what I've been hearing. Well, I was hoping I could move enough stuff out the way to see it. Yep, there it goes. It is a copper penny, a 1982 memorial. Definitely sounded a lot better than the junk I've been finding. All right, y'all, let's keep on keeping on. This top lot's got to have something good for your boy, right? Well, y'all, I'm not sure about this one, but I got to... I think I have something under here. We're going to have to crawl all the way under. Ow! <laughs> that was my dome. Okay. Ah! My shovel was behind me. Let's see. There she blows. Oh, just another coin. But hey, under the top lot, we always got to check those iffy signals. Let's put the... Uh-oh. No wonder. It was actually two coins. I'll take it, baby. Well, while we're under here, let's swing around a little bit. Okay. Okay, I think that's all that's under here. Might have to readjust my headphones here, readjust my camera after crawling around on the ground. And hold on, there's something over there. Okay, I think that was just a reflection. It looked like a ring for a minute. All right, on to the next one, y'all. All right, y'all, I got a little slide here, and I got me a 26 at the bottom of it. Be a good nickel signal, or it could be that gold ring I've been looking for. Dang it, just a nickel. <laughs> but hey, I'll take it. A nickel is five times better than a penny and a hundred times better than a pull tap. <laughs> All right, y'all, let's keep on keeping on. Well, all right, y'all, I got me a really high signal right here. Ugh. It's a 46, which is normally something decent. Unless it's super huge, but it doesn't seem to be super huge. So let's see. Well, it's a dime. <laughs> I've been finding pennies on pennies on pennies lately, so a dime is something nice to find, so I will take it. All right, let's keep on keeping on, baby. There's got me more goodies around here somewhere for us. On to the next one. Well, y'all, I got a high banger here on the top lot. And there she blows. Another quarter. 
I'm about to have to leave this top lot here. There's some kids that showed up. Dang, I was hoping that'd be a W quarter. <laughs> so uh, it's very possible this could be the last target of the day. I won't hit her at the basketball goal. So unless I find something over there, this might be the last one I see y'all on. All right, either on to the next one or either on to the wrap up. Yes, sir. Well, y'all, that was an interesting day of detecting. I didn't find any jewelry, but I found a couple weenies and a bunch of coins. Um, I had a good time, real good time. Um, unfortunately, a lot of the parks I was at, there was a lot of people. And unfortunately, <laughs> my two live digs this week, I'm sorry, there's going to be no audio from the detector. I my first park I was at, I tried to do my live dig. Let me scoot up here. I tried to do my live dig and I got photobombed by some kids twice. Um, they were coming to see what the beeping was about. What are you doing? What are you finding? What are you. Which, uh, don't get me wrong, <clears throat> I love to educate the young ones on what I'm doing, having fun and whatnot, but when you're trying to do a live video for YouTube and you don't want kids in your video, <laughs> that's not a good thing. So I went around to the other side of the park and came back the other way and I turned the volume off on my double score and I just kind of hung my he headphone down a little bit thinking y'all would be able to hear it, but unfortunately now with my wireless mic, with my old mic plugged into the back of my camera, it, it picked that up pretty well. Um, unfortunately, the wireless mic, I had it on my on my uh, strap for my chest mount, and it doesn't pick it up too well. And unfortunately, I tried to do the same thing with my Legend at my next by my next live hunt. And <laughs> so, sorry, you're not going to hear the tones this week, but it is what it is. Uh, you heard the tones of most of this video because most of this video was either shot before the kids photo on me or at a different park, so you're able to hear the tones. And that's why I like it. Uh, so let's get down to the lectured hand. I'm going to have a hard time this week. It's spring break. I don't know where I'm going to go hunting. <laughs> the beaches are full. The parks are full. I'm going to have to hunt the backyard. I don't know. <laughs> no, I'm going to find a park where no one's at and we're going to go detect. So let's get down to the lecture hand. Let's see what your boy came back with in his sack. I got to say, it was slim pickings for interesting finds. I found um, this interesting zipper pool. I found this piece of metal. I have no idea what it is, but it's green and it's got some writing on it of some sort. Uh, I did get a washer. I got this heavy, heavy two ounce weight with the little uh, loop to tie on to broke off. So that will be recycled. Um, I got five, 10, 15, 20, 21 regular pennies. I think that's a regular penny. It looks kind of old. Yeah, it's a regular penny. It does look kind of old. What is it? 72. Um, I got two nickels. I got five, eight uh, dimes, four, eight, nine, ten quarters. And then the star finds of today's show is this 1944 wheat penny and this 1954 wheat penny, which is kind of interesting because I have found a couple of other wheat pennies in that park. Um, honestly, being that this is spring break, I may go back to that park because it does have a really nice feel to it. Even if there's kids at the top lot and the basketball goal, and there's a fishing area in the back. It butts up against the bay and there's a long stretch there where people can fish. Uh, I may hit that. I may bring my magnet and go out and do a little magnet fishing. Who knows? We're going to have some fun and we're going to do what it is. Even if it's spring break, it's, it's not spring break for me, but it's still a day to go detecting. So until the next one, y'all, this is your buddy, the Texan detector. If y'all came along this long, I sure appreciate the hell out of you. Until the next time, happy hunting and stay dirty, my friends. Yes, sir.